All right, here's what we have. I'm setting up a new network. I wanted to use the gear that we have here. I have a Cisco ASA 5505. This is a, a firewall, and as you can see, it's a small one, and it's really simple. It's got about eight interfaces. One is usually for the inside, zero is for the outside, and that's the way it's going to be here. They're 100 megabits. They're not gigabit, so it has um, doesn't have the full capability of the bigger 5510s. 55 tons. You do have a slot for IPS modules and security stuff. There's where we have it plugged in our one interface, one interface going to our core. This is our core. These are newer 3750 switches with the uh, SFP modules for a copper or fiber. And the way what's interesting about these 3750s is that they're, they're stacked. As you can see in the back, they're stacked with these um, stack wise cables. And these stack wise cables. Um, make this switch all I do is configure this switch and this switch becomes a master as you can see right here there says master on the on the uh, LEDs that means this one's not master this is acting as one switch I only configure the top one and any one I add is part of this top one as one big switch as one core so if one goes dead um, it becomes the um, it, it be, that's still you could add or remove as needed. And then these SFP modules is what gives us our link to our access layer. And here's our access layer. See, this cable goes all the way around to our switches. And these are the closet switches for the users. Uh, so this is what the physical. And this is a Cisco. And it, it's, you can see it's different from a 3750. It's still 48 port. But, um, is 3560 and it's PoE power over Ethernet. That means you can plug a phone in and they'll get power. And uh, so this is what we're setting up right here for a school that I'm going to go build next week. And as you can see, so these are SFP modules. Um, so that's it. These are the 3750s G series. They do have PoE series. There's 48 ports. And they even have one that are just SFP ports. So there's various um, various ports you can use or various configurations of the 3750. What's interesting about it is they all can get stack-wise, just like over here. They're on stack-wise. So as you can see, this is the stack, how the stack is actually configured. And this one cable has to go to um, port 1, goes into port, uh, actually, yeah. This is port, port one here.